Hello. What's going on? What's going on, Damari? Not that much. How you doing? I'm doing good. How about yourself? Doing good. It's week 15, so we've got another episode of Let's Drive powered by Ford. Guys, this time we've got cornerback Damari Mathis here in the passenger seat. Damari, shall we go for a drive? Let's do it. All right. This is a nice truck. Yeah, welcome inside the Ford Bronco. Nice. It's nice, isn't it? Yep. So, Mari, how you doing? How you feeling? Feeling good, feeling healthy. Um, good. Just got out of practice. Feel like we've mm -hmm. been having a good week up to this point. Yeah. We're ready to get out there, show what we can do. Yeah, what's been kind of just the focus at practice this week? The mindset? Um, Just like what it is every week, doing our job, being able to be a um, really good secondary, being effective out there and cover guys. Yeah. Feel like we've been doing a good job like that. Yeah, for sure. I mean, you've been really impressive. Just stepping up each week. I know it's your rookie year. How has this, you know, first season really been for y'all? Uh, it's been a, a great learning experience. Um, like you said, as a rookie, I've been playing a lot of ball yeah. so far. And, you know, I'm just learning everything. And I feel like I'm getting better each week. So I think that's big to be young and being able to do that. For sure. Yeah, your first start was versus the Chargers, I believe. Were you... You know, just surprised that you got your first start so early on in the season in your rookie year? Yeah, I was. Um, but, you know, once my, my number was called, I was ready for it. Um, my sure. preparation and everything was where it needed to be. So I was ready to get in. Um, you know, that first game was kind of rough because I had all those PIs. But I've right. been working on my technique. Back, yeah. yeah, I've been working on my technique, make sure I'm not doing that anymore, make sure I'm playing clean out there. For sure. Yeah, what do you think's kind of been just the hardest – challenge in adjusting from you know the call from college to the NFL uh I feel like they definitely are more um calling more uh passing the friends calls yeah and then you know it, it's much different but than, than college because like when you get a PI call it's not like a yardage penalty it's a spot penalty in the NFL so those calls are like mm -hmm. can determine games for real so just yeah. having good technique um, is real big in the NFL. Have you seen yourself kind of, you know, each week, every week improve? Yeah, like I said, just like the more experience I've been having, it's feel like I'm getting more comfortable out there. And it's like, I'm not thinking as much. So, and it's like, with me having that experience, I'm starting to understand different things. And, yeah. you know, I'm being able to just play and just play out what I see, you know, instead of just out there with your head spinning everywhere. Right, yeah. for sure. Yeah, how have some of, you know, maybe the, the other guys in the secondary really helped you in just your adjustment to the to the league? I know you guys, you, you have guys like Justin Simmons, Kareem Jackson, you know, veterans yeah. and leaders on this team. Really, everybody in the whole secondary, all our starting guys and even guys that are not even playing, they just, you know, they're very helpful. Um, they kind of, like, guide us, us young guys, and to how we, how we should be and what to look for and how yeah. to watch film and just, you know, they're just a good group of guys to be around. I'm glad that I'm in this group. For sure. Yeah. And I hear the guys, they call you Showtime? Yeah, they call me Showtime. Oh, that's your nickname in the locker room? Yeah, that's my nickname. I got that uh, yeah, tell here. Me, tell me why. Yeah, I got that. Uh, we had a little talent show. And, um, you know, I rap. I be making music, so. Oh. Um, yeah, I be making music, so. I did. On a talent show, uh, I just, I performed one of my songs. And everybody yeah. was just in there, like, going crazy. Like, this is an original? Yeah. Okay, well. We gotta hear it. Oh, oh wait. <laughs> nah. Can't say that. Nah, nah, nah. You, you might gotta wait. We gotta stay tuned for that. Maybe after the season, you know, focus right now. Okay, okay. <laughs> I know. can't even get a little something just now. Uh, come on. We gonna have to wait. We gonna have to wait. We gonna have to wait. We gonna have to okay, wait for that fine. one. But you put up a show. Yeah, Everyone yeah, yeah. Was yeah. Everybody was going crazy. Impressed. They was going crazy, man. You know, KJ gave me that name, Showtime. Oh, right. everybody called me that. <laughs> yep. Well, I can't wait to, you know, hear some of those bars. Maybe a little bit later on. Yep. I'm going to come find you in a couple weeks. Yep. Well, Damari, you know, we're back at home this weekend. Cardinals are coming to town. What do you think is the key, really, to, you know, going up against guys like DeAndre Hopkins, Hollywood Brown, you know, this Cardinals receiving core? Yeah, just like I said, just being able to do our job, you know, I feel like we're a really good secondary in this league. And, yeah. You know, we just got to keep taking steps forward and mm -hmm. like you said going against guys like D Hop, really good receivers, better receivers that have a lot of experience in this game. Just being able to do our job, I feel like we're gonna go a long way for with sure. that. Yeah. We got, you know, four games left in the season here. For you personally, kinda what are your goals 
for the rest of the season. To get a win. So Heck yeah. I, I feel like that's the biggest goal for me and us right now as a team to get a win and, you know, move forward from there. Maybe an interception? Yeah, definitely interception. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. But I, I want to get a win first. I feel like even sure. if I got an interception without the win, it wouldn't be the same. Be but special. yeah, definitely an interception. That's <laughs> not, I've been waiting for that each week. Right. I'm ready. It's going to come, though. I know. I talked to Pat after, you know, Sunday's game, and I know he had been itching for one, and he finally yeah. got his first one of the season. Yeah, you got to be patient. It's going to come. When the ball comes, you got to be ready. Yep. Yep. Well, excited to be back at home this weekend. You got any family coming up? Oh, uh, yeah, I actually do. I got my dad, my stepmom coming. Oh, good. Yep. Well, that'll be fun. Have they been to a lot of games this year? They've been to two games so far. Oh, nice. Yeah. Where, where do they live? They live in Lakeland, Florida. I'm from Florida. Oh, okay. Yeah. Same as me. Yep. Not from Lakeland. What part? Daytona Beach. Oh, you're from Daytona. That's, yeah. That's like, an hour, that's like an hour 30. Yeah. That's not bad. Yep. Well, excited to be back in Empower Field at Mile High this Sunday. Tomorrow, I appreciate you coming for a drive today. I appreciate you having me.